Good morning, this is Burn Raiden. Welcome back to Planet Peace, where we are getting closer and closer every moment to our goal of 300 citizens or colonists losing robots there. Let's see, we just have more coming in. My food production is getting a little low. Three engineers, wow, that is a lot, but I did up those. So, where are we? What I need to do is I just built this biodome and I filled out the. Uh, oh gosh, that's not good. There's a lot of repair signs there. Let me check this out here. Um, I'm going to pull that back up, that 5% back up in the biologists. So I do need another, what's it called? Meat pad? Meat pad? Meat dome? We're about to hit 300 here. As soon as we hit 300, I'm going to turn it off. Because a guard, a worker, and a guard. Come on. No biologists for me. I just upped the percentage. But, um, yeah, I do need another meat pad. The vegetables aren't doing too bad. These guys are all working pretty hard down here. And none of my storage is full, which is good. Solar flare is imminent. I remember the last time. Yep, there we go. What do we got? We're going to get some sick workers. Or maybe not. It looks like everyone got in. I didn't have any building projects going on, so I think everyone's fine. But yeah. Is this trade ship over here? Ooh, drill a robot. I have 54 medicine. It's a lot. It's good for when the, the sick people come, though. Those visitor things. Ah. Trade. All right, let's speed it up so we don't have to listen to the alert for very long. And this is gonna go till about midday, I think. Two bots irreversibly damaged. I sh they should say irrevocably damaged. That'd be better. So how much? We have 50 robots, but we need 25%. So 25% of uh, 300 would be. 30, 60, 60, and then 70, 75, yeah? Excellent status too, things are really doing good. So I need I need 25 more robots if I want to get the 300 thing going on. Oh, I can turn this off now. More colonists, give me some biologists please. Just one biologist? I guess this is better than none biologist. I feel like I should have more with these percentages. But yeah, things are going excellent, it appears. I, I only need two more people. Yeah, I do need more food. Oh, is this it? Is this it? Am I going to hit my consolidation reached? Wonderful. Three more biologists. Perfect. I'm turning off colonists. Good. We have ten milestones. Let's take a look. Ta-da! Now we have to get the achievement where we have all ten milestones on all three planets. More more damaged robots, more visitors, more money. The trade ship? Nice. Give me some robots. I don't know, can I even buy all these three? Eight twelve. Um no. Yeah. Pay for them, I guess. I don't have much food. Oh no, I have plenty of vegetables. My meat's going up too. I gotta expand a little bit. So let me go up to 812 here total. I really want to get 75 robots. I think I have 301 people. So maybe I need 76. I guess it depends on how the rounding is. Yeah, I have 301. So our vegetables took a nice uptick with that farm, and I think that may, the extra vegetables might have helped stabilize the meat. So, and we're not going to, so I'm going to watch those numbers for a while. I have colonization turned off, so I think any more changes will be a bit slower, um, easier to deal with. Oh wow, we had a dip in water last night. Oh, I did add all that, that stuff. What's it called? So let me put out a, nope. Nope. Yeah, the increasing number of robots too is also very helpful with the 
morale. Having more lasers, less people dying and stuff. See, it's going down at night. The night's almost over. We'll be fine. We have enough water storage. Water does not need much storage, like, ever. So, our welfare is good. And I think there's an achievement for having the 95% welfare when you have over 100 people, which would be cool to get. Uh, so we need more robots for that. Um, probably more entertainment stuff. Like people are eating, everything's fine with that. He's hungry. People are doing really good actually. There's a lot less frowny faces than there used to be. There's still some very frowny faces though. Maybe when I connect around back, I can, uh, what's it called? Or visitors. Uh oh, uh oh. That's a lot of visitors and they're all angry. There, there's my little army rolling in. I might lose a couple guys. They're over this side too. That's because I saw a lot. There's a lot came in their ship left. They're like, peace? Come on. Detect the crazies. Or is that a regular visitor? I didn't see how many came out of that ship. Oh, see there? I knew it were a bad one. And there's more over here too. Nice. Three more killed. Okay, I think that's all of them. And not a guard lost. Excellent. I love watching the, the actual, like, without the game speeded up. Looking at the ships is actually really neat. Uh-oh, he's sick. Flu. Don't give the flu to anyone else, you weirdo. Are they putting medicine in here? Oh, yeah, nice. Look at that. You guys are great. I would like to have more, I guess, entertainment stuff down at this end. Although I do have a lot. Like, there's this, this bar. And there's a, a bunch of TVs in here. And this multi-dome. And another bar. I wonder if making this connection would do anything for anyone. I don't think so. I mean, all the fun facilities are not being used. It's just people have a lot of work to do and long distances to walk sometimes. Which just means we need more robots. We need 21 more robots, which will be really cool. Let's speed things up again. See, there's a lot of unhappy people down this end. There's this multi-dome. I guess they're not going past um, here, really. It's a lot of meat, meat machines. Uh, what did I want to build down here? I wanted to build something. So this is a canteen and this is a bar and there's the, uh, oh that's not good let me build a man I'm losing robots left and right a little bump there huh if I can connect both of these I think I'd be happy like that but it looks like I don't know I lost the TV See, I want to be able to connect both of those. There, that might work. Nice. And then I can put another... I want to put like two more buildings over here and then two dorms off of those. But I'm not sure exactly what I want to put. We don't need much more. We don't really need storage over here. The factories are good. I mean, we have 38 spares, we're making, we have semiconductors, we have a lot of production, our production is good. We don't really need more in the terms of production, just more fun stuff. I mean, I could do another bar or another multi-dome down here, but then that's so far away from, like, workspace. I should make a, an airlock here, so they can, like, go back and forth easily. I wonder if they will path in between airlocks, or they try and stay inside the base all the time. Nice trade ship here. 
I'll buy a robot. I don't really have anything else to sell. I'm still making a pretty good income on visitors, though. Trade. Robot. We're now up to... Oh, we're down to 54. This is still high priority. What are you guys missing? Bioplastics. We have 54. It's kind of annoying. I think I do want to put another storage here. I'll put it more... I'll put a giant one, why not? I can connect it to all three of these. We're gonna lose a TV though. What's that oxygen? This thing. Yep, I know. I'm building this guy over here. So you won't be out of oxygen ever again. Visitor ship. Let me check my power. It's good. Still, still getting a little below the halfway mark, but I think if I start trending downward, I have a good amount of time to uh, to back up on that. There's a lot of connections here. I hope someone doesn't lock themselves in or a robot or something. Let me watch just to make sure I'll recycle the connection if I need to. This is pen oh, it's still pending a bunch of stuff. And I would like to replace all of the dorms with cabins. But I need to build a lot of cabins. And I think if I turn this off of um, priority, uh, my welfare will go up actually a meaningful amount as well. Because then those engineers won't be forced to work down here so much. They're not forced to work down here so much. It's not that bad. But yeah, there's still a lot of... Like this... This dorm, if I could get rid of this dorm and make it one cabin there. And then, where's my other dorms? No, that's a meat factory. There's one down here. Well, that's good for visitors, though. I guess I can keep the dorms by the visitors. Like, this one would be a good... I have to figure out how to attach this this stuff if I got unless I got rid of those power collectors I don't know I'm just trying to think about ways that I can up my up my what's it called happiness levels so you guys down here build a nice big multi dome and can I stick an airlock in here and just sneak one in no 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 so let me see if, oops, that's not what I want. I just want to make sure I can build two cabins in here. Yeah, perfect. And then, other than that, I did want to build another, let me build a, a small oxygen. Oh, this is the stuff. So I don't really need more oxygen, I just would like to have a generator in front of an airlock, is all it is. And we can do that here. Come on robot, stop getting damaged, I need the numbers to go up. There's no bioplastics over here. This is kind of annoying. They're not filling these things up very well. I guess I wonder if the priority does not apply to filling and it only applies to work. That's an interesting thing. So they built that. They're going to build these. This is my, my multi-dome. I love the hamster wheels. I also love symmetry. some televisions. Probably lose some of these. Planet Base News. 
uh, benches. I don't see. It's super annoying. Let me do that. Now let me place benches over here. Can I really not place a single... Oh, there we go. But it doesn't work on the other side. Is it because there's TVs there? You can't place benches near TVs? Let me try this. We got armed intruders. Yes. Okay, so the TVs are just getting in the way, really. So let's see if I take out the rest of the TVs, if I can put in benches. There we go. Why do the benches get in the way of the TVs? It's super annoying. Okay, now is there... See, now if I have the bench like this, so this is... These are wrong. Yes, recycle. Now build me a hamster wheel like this. I'll place a bench here. I'll build a... See? Now it doesn't want to build a thing. No. Oh, there's already one there. Nice. Okay, so if I do... Let's see if I do this. I can put a hamster wheel on each side. And then I can put water fountains, because people need to drink water or they die. I like having excess water fountains. It makes me feel better about, like, there we go. Beautiful. Oh, there's even room for another plant. I like it. Now can we fit any TVs in? Oh, there's one. That's it. Whee! Okay. And now we have two more dorms. Very nice. This should help with happiness a little bit. Although, I don't know, the travel distance down here might be a little obnoxious. Just need more robots. I want to get my robot. See, down to 52. Come on, guys. Look. Like, what are you doing over here? No one's bringing you bioplastics. Are they all. Like, they can't. I can't have 56 being used somewhere. There's starch. This thing is huge. Uh oh. So we never see there's a ton of bioplastics in here. Where are you taking it? Oh, you're building stuff with it. Okay, let's speed back up. Speed back up. And here we go. And this needs more biologists. We better colonize the moon soon, because the Earth has been destroyed by global warming and everyone's dead. There's only a billion people left. So we need to spread throughout the galaxy to survive. But, uh, see, I don't want to buy them, because then they'll go out there and carry them inside. I'll buy some. I'll buy all of these, why not? Try and get a bit of a good surplus going. There we go. Get a little bit of cash back. Nope. Ten coins. So that'll be carried out there in no time. Some visitors coming in to visit. Get some much needed supplies. They're not really on vacation. They're more like, oh my gosh, I almost starved to death in my spaceship and I really need help. And I have a little bit of coins. If I'm a huge colony and I only have 616 coins, maybe they're like bitcoins and each coin is worth like $800 or something. I don't know how much they're worth now. 
They were pretty crazy for a while there. So, why are you so unhappy? Don't be mad. Go do something fun. How do you get to this state? And why are engineers bringing stuff? You should be building robots. I'm being really upset with you guys. Laxia, our food's doing great now. Damn, I'm getting too much food. Uh oh. Get hungry, people. Get happy, actually. My status is only decent. Why? Why, why, why? Am I telling them to do too much work? I guess if I leave them off for a while from jobs, it'll come back up. Let's do that. Let's do that and see what happens. Of course, they need to bring all this bioplastic in, but whatever. Hopefully, they'll bring it down to the robot production facilities. There's not a thing in here. No one's even working on that one. This one at least has some re material. No? It's got a couple things. They just don't care. Look at all the spares being used out there. That's cool. You can see the sparks from so far away. How's power doing? Power's looking good. Uh, how about water? Water is still draining at night, interestingly enough. So I'm going to put another one out. Just for that safety buffer. More traders? No, no thanks. Still got a lot of bioplastics to carry in. A lot of the robots are doing the work at least, which is good. Look at all those wonderful carrier bots. But it's not enough. I need more. I need 20 more. Ooh. That wasn't good. Get it. This is the area which almost cost me this base. When this biodome ran out of O2. I almost lost everything early on. A lot of visitors. Get that money and cash comes up quick. I'm not even intercepting transmissions and stuff. So where's the greatest concentration of unhappy people? There's a lot of unhappy people here. But at least they're working on it. Checking out a plant. No, he's using the exercise bar. And they're here too, eating. So there's a lot of unhappy people over here. Up here it's not too... Oh, there's a couple. They're always in the, in the restaurants. They get unhappy. So where else are we? They're sca they seem to be scattered around pretty evenly. And there's no one sleeping down here. Miyakan, worker, using treadmill. That's a lot of food. I think we need to let more colonists in. Otherwise our storage is going to start to spill. See, that's bad if the storage fills up. Then we have this, like, people carry to the other section problem. So let's do that. Uh, colonist. Solar flare detected. We'll bring in some more people. I did not expect to have such a huge surplus of food. I thought it was going down still. Let's check this out. Let's go to the engineers. Maybe we'll get some more robots building. If we get some more colonists, which I believe we will. See, there's people tired down here. I feel like they're having to walk too far and go to too many places to get all their needs met. Solar flare hitting soon. So I guess in the AM that's going to pop out. But... I don't know. I'm trying to take it slow here. I'm trying to balance my colony now that I've reached the 10 milestones. I'm not going to try and expand too much. I want to see if I can successfully balance it, you know, so it can live in harmony for a long, long time. I do need more biologists, though. But bring the freaking bioplastics here, man. I could make another production facility over here. Look, I have 103. They just, they just don't care about these things. 
I don't know. I'm going to take a break here. When the morning comes, I'll probably go, oh, there's a solar flare. And then what happened? And then I I'll forget. But anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. The episode's getting kind of slow, but I'm still enjoying it. Now we've got some more colonists coming in. Um, I'm going to have to spend some work on uh, checking out how to optimize this base out. I, I did expand pretty rapidly. So I was just kind of generally trying to alternate things, you know, like needs as they came up. But there's definitely some planning that I could improve on. And I think I do want to join these two and then cut off this area and rebuild it. And I can replace some of the dorms and stuff. And that'll be an interesting thing to do to see how the base handles that change in, in design. And who knows, maybe I'll leave it that way if people get much happier and things are working out better. Oh, here comes a solar flare. So... At least I won't have to forget that. But anyway, in this state of emergency, I will leave you. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And until the next video, have fun.